Hey guys, Ryan with Southern Reptiles here. This is actually my Florida box turtle enclosure. I guess I'll wait a minute for some people to jump on. So this right here is my Florida box turtle enclosure. As you can see, it's a little overgrown. They have a lot of space to hide, which is nice. You can see one down here. That's actually my male. And this right here is my female. So it just rained really, really hard here in South Florida. And generally when it rains a lot, I like to come out and look for babies that may have hatched. So, look what I just found. Just found these guys about 10 minutes ago, running around in this giant enclosure. Found both of these right after the rainstorm. That one's a little more outgoing. This one's a little more shy. Just as beautiful though. But yeah. I literally just walked right out here and you see this little spot where there's no grass. They were both just sitting right there. They must have both just came up out of the ground at the same time. You know, sometimes they'll sit in the nest after they hatch for a week or even two weeks sometimes. And um, they just came right up out of the ground. It's pretty cool. So my Florida box turtles are actually doing pretty well in Florida. Go figure. And they're breeding up a storm and producing some beautiful captive born babies. Look at that shell. These little guys will eat Missouri tortoise diet. Oh, Mary Sue, I love them. Yeah, we were just talking about this the other day. <laughs> she has Florida box turtles too. So yeah, pretty cool. It's fun that, you know, nature finds a way. We don't always have to be in the middle of it and dig up the eggs and incubate them. They can do it on their own. And so thought everybody would just be interested. You can see my Russian tortoises are out running around too, waiting for some food. But yeah, so I'm going to keep looking for some babies. That's probably it. My female only usually lays two eggs at a time. So that was probably a clutch laid about three months ago or so. Three to four months ago. All right. Well, Ryan with Southern Reptiles. Thanks for tuning in and everybody have a good Sunday evening.